How you doing, YouTube? Matt Massa Beer Reviews back with a little bit of beer mail. New viewer beer mail. First time beer mail. Courtesy of Daniel from Wisconsin. Thank you very much, brother. Uh, yeah, he wrote me a bit ago. He's like, hey, man, I'd love to send you some beer from a specific brewery in Wisconsin. I don't remember what that brewery is. We're going to find out because we're going to open this one. We'll see what's what. Yeah, we're post online beer share. I just, uh, while I was doing. The online community beer share, the online massive community beer share. Uh, my wife was like, hey, beer mail in the fridge. I didn't even do anything. And beer shows up. That's what I like to see. So let's crack in this sucker, see what she's got. So, okay. Bottles. I love me some bottles. What do we have going on here? Are they all the same beer or are they different? Oh, I think I have a note in here too. Okay. What we got going on here? This is a brewery called hmm, Tynara. No idea what's going on here. There's actually an invoice in here, which is really weird. Okay, legendary Wisconsin beer. So we'll see what's what. This could be actually from a brewer or a brewery rep or something like that. I don't know. We didn't have a deep conversation. Um, so these are actually three different beers, but they look exactly the same. It says uh, Legendary Wisconsin Beer, Lake Mills, Wisconsin, Tyranena, Tyranena, Tyranena. I don't know. How do you say that? Tyranena. Um, it says Brewers Gone Wild, a series of big, bold, ballsy beers, and they're all three different beers. On one here, we have Coco Poco, which is an Imperial Coconut Porter Asian Rum Barrels. Fuck yeah. Uh, notes. Put uh, you put. The beer in the coconut, and drink them both together, put the beer in the barrel, and then it tastes better. Put beer in the coconut, drink them both up. I kind of like what's going on here. This is kind of ghetto in a very, very cool way. October 23rd, 2019, this was bottled, so this one's pretty fresh over here. Um, in this one, we have Carnal Knowledge in the Morn. Double oatmeal style aged in bourbon barrels with cocoa dips, coffee, and vanilla beans. Okay. Uh, in the morning, it doesn't say you love me. Serve me up with a richness of a chocolate and caramel malts blended with cocoa, uh, coffee, cocoa, and notes of vanilla and bourbon. Stained wood. Won't need too much persuading. There's something weird about these beers and the wording. Maybe I'm just butchering them, but I like them. And last but not least, we have The Devil Made Me Do It. It's an imperial oatmeal porter brewed with coffee beans, a big old black beer with oatmeal sil uh, sick silkness. Jim, words are hard. Uh, full bodied with a, a soothingly rich coffee flavors. Devilishly delicious. Yeah, so we have two barrel aid jams and a coffee oatmeal jam over here. This one, October of 2019, this was bottled. Um, this looks like August of 2019. And then we have here um, a little October again, 2019. So, yeah, it's kind of weird because it's like it looks like the same beer over and over again. But if you look up top here on the sides, you can see they are different beers. So, yeah, we'll see if I post this video. If it's from an actual um, person, I will post it. If it's from the brewery themselves, then probably not because... Usually don't post unboxings from breweries, but yeah, these look absolutely super fucking cool. So yeah, thank you very much, Daniel, for sending these off. Can't wait to dive in on them. Love me some barrel aged jams. New brewery. Something about the labels kind of remind me of like um, and it's weird because they go with this kind of Coco Poco over here. They go with the kind of Jamaican theme on it. It kind of reminds me of a beer that would come from like uh, uh, South America or Spain or something like that. Just got kind of like a Caribbean kind of Mediterranean kind of sensibility about the way the beer is laid out. It's in a bottle. The name I don't know what it is. We're gonna find out. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the unboxing. Hopefully you enjoy me and review these suckers, and hopefully see you next time. Cheers.